Good morning, everybody. It's a little chilly here at Rose Cottage Acres today. We've had a really big storm blew through and it's kind of cold afterwards and we're gonna probably have our first frost today. So that's gonna be a big change for the garden. But we also have something else going on today. I'm selling 10 of my male quail because it's way too many. I don't need an extra 10 gentlemen hanging around. And then I've also been able to figure out pretty much which ones are boys and girls. So I've got them set up into three groups. I also have an additional pair. I don't need 27. I'm good with 25. So I've got an additional pair that I'm probably going to try to sell in the near future. They're very well bonded. And I think they might actually even be able to go broody and raise their own young because they have immediately bonded together very closely. So these 10 pretty boys are going to go to new homes. They're nice big guys and honestly, I'm assuming they're actually going to go to Thanksgiving dinner. So it's kind of a shame because they're beautiful, but that's what quail are for. This is my bonded pair I'm still looking to find a home for. It's a male, oh, he keeps moving around. It's a male's nail on the right. And then these four are tuxedos. They're really pretty. I'm pretty sure I have one male and three female in them. It's a little hard to tell. But I think so. I honestly haven't checked to see what all of these are yet. I'm just keeping them because they're pretty. That is the sound of, of um male quail crowing. They're not too loud. These are two of the standard colored quail hens here in the front. Uh, a couple more friends in here. I have a beautiful standard male who's very sweet and friendly. And you can see these guys over there hanging towards the front. This is definitely my friendliest bunch. And even though they're not beautiful colors, they're really sweethearts, so I'm keeping them just because I like them. And then over here I have four more that I'm pretty sure are hens. I'm going to add my tuxedos to this bunch. There are a couple tuxedos in there, but a couple of the normal color as well. I'm probably going to end up rehemming one or two more eventually because I do have Tux, my little one, that I still don't know if he's ever going to survive and two of his friends in the house. They're sitting in the laundry room. So just to show you, they have gotten really big. They're very active. They're very curious. Not eating a lot yet green-wise. I put greens in and they're very cautious about them still. But they do enjoy the little hideout and their house in the back. And this one tries to hop out every chance you get. There's my little boy. Hi, handsome. How you doing? But yeah, these these are the tamest these are the tamest ones for sure. So the gentleman who bought my nice big delicious looking quail came and got them and he also gave me samples of his soups. These look amazing. Look at this. Cecil Sunset and Snowfall soup. So they make their own soups. Farm care soup, and he has a lot of different varieties. But I'm excited to be able to try these really nice homemade soups. So that was an, a nice and unexpected bonus to selling a couple of my extra boy quail today. <laughs> 